guys, welcome back to another episode of the Vampire Diaries. Today we'll be watching episode 15, The Dinner Party. Let's not wait any further because it's getting really great and really exciting. From the previous episode, we ended off in a proper cliffhanger in a way where Tyler is heading off somewhere with Jules and I want to know more about their storyline, where Jules is from. I want to know more about Elijah's proposition to kill Klaus, but then he, Klaus has uh, Luca's sister. There's so much going on. Like, let's not wait any further. Let's just get right to the episode. The monsters we drove to their fiery deaths have begat new monsters. Did you hear that? Yep, we did. Is that Elijah? We proved there are no vampires. Oh, there you go. There it goes. There it goes. Thomas! Thomas is gone, babes. <laughs> I saw the vampire who killed me. I recognized him. Oh. If the vampire killed you, how is it possible that you were able to write that? <laughs> Killing Elijah. Oh. It's an original. You don't know what all that encompasses. Oh, trust me, Stefan. I'm gonna dot all my T's. I don't want any surprises. Mm. Wow, Damon. Are we actually gonna be careful for once? Yes, Stefan. I've become you. How tragic for both of us. Gotta run. Have a murder plan. A busy day. Wow, Damon. Wow. Very yes, they are. Whoa. Yeah, I got your uh, your message about walking Elijah here through the old property lines. I thought I would uh, tag along, you know, being a history buff and all. We want to be really taking a piss. <laughs> What's your next? You're one of those people on the latest list of loved ones to protect. Yeah, so is John. You don't have to be jealous. I really pursue younger women. It's a joke, Rick, like that. <laughs> One minute I'm playing pool, and the next I'm waking up in a bathroom stall. Sorry, Luca, but everything seemed normal yesterday. I, mean, I brought you a coffee, and we play pool. I think you're lying. But I think you need to back off. Whoa, whoa, Jeremy, chill. Oh, wow, so he completely cannot remember. Atlanta, you've agreed to sacrifice yourself to Klaus. Mm. To say that we have a difference of opinion is an understatement of the century. Here, here. You would know. That's what I don't understand. How is it possible for Jonathan Gilbert to write back saying that he killed, he was killed by Stefan? I didn't know about Jonathan Gilbert train yet. I didn't know that he would. Oh. That he would survive. Oh shit! I didn't know that. That's what I was. I completely forgot the ring. Oh my god! You are literally Damon. Bringing them here when the entire town is hunted. Leave this place, never think of it again. Same for you. I'm done here. Damon, I'll do better. I promise. No. You will get us killed. I'd rather leave you to do that to yourself. Oh my god, that's when he left and then the then. first that's episode. Oh my god, that links the first like episode. Demon. Yeah. Oh, it was And she's been compelled not to bulge my secret time. Mm-hmm. Wow. Let's have a dinner party. Ooh, my girl, full of good ideas. I'll be happy to host. Damn. Oh, my God, Catherine. I mean, you want Elijah and Klaus dead as much as I do. Klaus? Yes, Elijah, no. He's compelled me to stay in here. If he dies, I'm stuck forever. Oh. Ah. for you. Even with a dagger and a little white oak ash. If you kill Elijah, then I'm stuck in here forever. I'll help you kill Elijah or, or protect Elena, whatever you want. I get you out of here and your ass is sipping Klaus free margaritas. <laughs> no way. I yes. indeed confirm that it's possible to kill an original, which I will do tonight. Damn, Damon. Guess what's going to be done. Oh my god. Why, why, what's happened? I'm an idiot, are you? Lexi! Y your best friend, Lexi, that's how you met her? What was she even doing in Mystic Falls? She had heard it was a good place for vampires to go. Had no idea that they'd all been massacred. Oh my god! Oh my god, you're a ripper. A what? There are good parts of being a vampire and there are bad parts. You're the bad parts. Mm. That's how. Oh my god! Lexi changed him! So what's what's going on with you and Alaric? I really like him. It's more than like, Ooh. and I want it to work, but I can't help but feel that he's hiding something from me. Oh. And now I've got John whispering things in my ear about him. No surprise plans, nothing that's going to put Jenna in harm's way, okay? Scouts on her. I don't like the fact that they're talking about Jenna's safety quite a lot. Jenna needs help with the wine. No, there's too much Jenna in this episode. Jenna, Jenna, Jenna. Elijah's stronger than me. It's faster than me. 
it's all about the element of surprise. Well, Jenna told me she was coming to a dinner party for Eliza. I decided I couldn't miss out on all the fun and games. Oh, God. <laughs> this is a date. Jeremy, I need to make sure Elena's cool with us before anything else happens. You did like it, right? I liked it. Yeah, I could tell. You guys really enjoyed it. Having at each other's faces, goodness. See, if you have a less than honorable intentions about how this evening is going to proceed, I suggest you reconsider. Damon, please be careful. If you so much as make a move to cross me, I'll kill you and I'll kill everyone in this house. Nuclear. Crystal. See, this is not great. The lore says that there was this wave of anti-witch hysteria that broke out in the neighboring settlement. So these witches were rounded up. They were tied to stakes in a field together and uh, burned. Some say you could hear the screams from miles around us. They were consumed by the fire. Oh, 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 oh. You researched the originals. You don't say. Oh my god, the dagger. The wood from one tree and one tree alone, an ancient white oak, would bring death to an original vampire. He was trying to figure out how to kill an original. It must be brandished by humans alone, for it will bring death to all demons who wield it. What? I was trying to get Damon killed. <gasps> no, Damon! No, 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 no. Damon, pick up your phone, pick up your phone. Freaking out. Oh my god, John Gilbert, you actual asshole. I really mentioned that you haven't been completely honest with her about your dead wife. I think I've been very clear with you, Rick. I want my ring back. You don't deserve it. If you die, we don't want you back. No, no, no. Before they existed, people actually had memories. No! Good, good, don't say it. <laughs> don't put it in the fire. When you got to hear it's missing. <laughs> I don't take chances, yeah? I'll get rid of him before Jenna comes back with this herd. Oh, Holy God! Yes, it is, even if you don't want to admit it. You are giving up. And Lexi, she wouldn't let me give up. I'm not gonna let you. All of these men are dead or dying. Nothing, I feel nothing. Because you shut out the part of you that was human. The part that lets you feel. <laughs> is that not the point? Well, there's a better way. You said we have to want it. Want Why would I want to do that? Because once you can hurt, can love. Wow, let's love see. Stephen. That's the point. Oh, now I miss her. That's what they fight for. He said there wasn't going to be any violence. Says the guy. Did all the yeah. Hey, I took the shot because I saw an opening. Not because I planned to do this with Jenna in the house. Now, you can't lie to me like that. Hey, I am your friend, damn it. And you don't have any friends. But guys, I can't trust this dagger. I feel like he'll just come back. As long as the dagger stays in place. Wait, what? Oh my god, they- What happened? I need you to find Elena. They freaking removed it. Oh, see, I knew! Whoa. <gasps> the hell are you doing here? No! What did your son tell you? About your daughter? No class has her. No, no. What is he doing? Making him forget? He took my pals. Oh my god! Don't, don't, don't! There was a misunderstanding. No, not this shit again. Not this again. Not this again. Please, Elijah, we got your stunt. Literally, Elena had no idea that was gonna happen, so don't do anything to her friends. Feed me his blood to heal me, and then I'll kill myself and become a vampire, just like Catherine did. So unless you want that to happen again, promise me the same as before. Promise me. Elena! Elena! <gasps> Give me my word. <laughs> John is right, and maybe you're not being honest with me. That was an answer. You actual literal asshole. Kill him right now. What are you doing? Baking. It's yours. 
after what you did to Damon. But Bonnie lost her powers. From this moment on, we're doing it my way. Oh. Okay. You have a deal, darling. You're negotiating a deal yet once again. Seems like she's had a change of attitude. How did you get through to her? Told her a uh, little story. The one you killed? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you remember her? Damon. You know we cannot forgive you. Even I cannot forgive you for that. But you're you're changing, which I respect. You must be the vampire I hear my brother complaining about. That would be me. You know the hate you're feeling towards Stefan, towards everyone? You think you have it under control, but you don't. It will get the best of you. I'll help him. Hello, Damon. What the hell? How did you get out? Originals can compel vampires, but as soon as they die, compulsion wears off. And you knew. Remember what I said, Damon? I'm going to help you. <laughs> God, this is insane, this episode. Sorry, I could refuse to believe that this girl was actually... I thought that she was okay and she might actually do some good, but no, no, she's the exact opposite. Holy crap, that was an outstanding episode. That entire sequence, I honestly did not think it would go that way. From the moment they realized that a human is the only person that can kill an original with the dagger, not a vampire, because they have a bond and whatnot, vampires can't do that to other vampires. From that time to Rick killing him, then removing the dagger, putting him back in the, the cell, and then realizing that the dagger should have been in him that entire time and it should not be removed. To then him coming to Elena and then her negotiating, her stabbing herself. And then I don't think he even Elijah knew that that was the dagger. But she just thought it was just an ordinary knife. And when she stabbed him and went to him and then she stabbed him. What the hell? This episode honestly was fantastic. I think that was the best part of this episode nothing more and also now that um the the wall rock john or jason whatever his name is he has now stolen bonnie's powers i think maybe in a way in a way i'm not gonna lie i feel like it's what he says is true that it's for your own good i'm gonna take away your powers only on that basis because they may do anything and everything to harm bonnie and make her you know, feel more pain just because she's a witch. I don't know, maybe, I'm not too sure. It could be right, could be wrong, but I think in that moment, it was good. And I think he will give it back to her now that he has found out that Elijah is dead. But the problem is that now that Elijah is dead, I don't know if they are going to get um, the sister back from Klaus. So like, how are they going to get her back? Unless they go straight and like, you know, pose a threat, threat to Klaus and say that, look, Klaus, here I am, doppelganger, um, a human, you come and get me. And then after that, they draw him out and then kill him and then the sister's safe. So there are many people that need to be considered in this line of work. But um, that was insane, guys. Whoa, whoa. I, like, forget about the Tyler story. I don't even give two craps about it now. This was some crazy crap, which I loved. And I want more of such scenes. I want more of suspense and shocking moments, which I never thought would happen. And the fact that Jonathan Gilbert, when I thought that he recorded this, I was like, how is this possible? I forgot that he had a ring and that ring has been passed down to the Gilberts. And then that's how he was able to write down and document everything that happened with him it's nuts like even the dagger bit like wow like there was an ancient tree like why is that ancient tree the tree that was is used to be killed um the originals like who made that tree like a poison or whatever it has and that ash is now used for that particular dagger that the witches have um put a spell on it and once you pierce an original with it the ash touches and meets the original and it kills and you should not remove it and only a human can do it because vampires can't do it to other vampires. Like, that's some really good writing. Honestly, 
but this episode was insane i have no more words i want to continue on and now that elena has made it clear to the both both the brothers that this is the way it's going to happen it's my way or no other way that that is she's really not having it she's not playing around she's very smart and i really like that. i hope she's fine i mean she did get stabbed but i know that uh, stefan gave her blood it's just that you know like in that moment just holy crap like take it <laughs> don't do such stunts but she was really amazing in this episode and i love 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 the fact that they brought lexi in this episode and you know her story when she came to mystic falls thinking that the vampires were there and that it would be safe for the vampires but she was never aware that they had been uh put in a church and burned down by the people of um, mystic falls those who were against the demons and what not and lexi throughout that time guiding stefan to fight his urge to kill and feed on people and you know find that other side of the good side of being a vampire now that he's already a vampire and you know just see that he can uh you know love and he can put that urge to do all the things that he shouldn't be doing if he was human like also being a vampire and also feeling human at the same time like she's not shutting it out entirely i love that storyline and i love the fact that she's also she also conveyed that to damon and in the end damon to prove a point to sheriff forbes and say that there are vampires and that lexi was new at the time it was an easy way to kill her and it was so uh, that was that was heartbreaking now that we saw a little bit of back story as to how she came into mystic falls and how she met stefan the death makes it all the more horrific to recall and like oh shit this is not the way i thought it would be so in that aspect no one can ever forgive damon even damon fans can never forget that like like I, that's insane but this episode top notch 10 out of 10 i loved it so i'm very excited to continue on episode 16 until then thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this episode please don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't please don't forget to wear a mask and stay safe for your friends and family until then guys i will see you in episode 16